After hearing that the magic guild, Gallon will expect a full report. Why don't you meet me there after you've had a chance to look around the city? I already looked around the city. <clears throat> I guess I can see if there's new weapons or anything. Alex has as much defense as he can get. <clears throat> Where was the weapon shop? Found it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't really want to look around. We already did that. Lemia is ready to meet you. Wait for at the rear of the Grand Hall. Alex, you must behave with the utmost respect in the presence of Lemia. I'm serious. Do you think she's going to give us a reward, Alex? And I could I trade it for fish? <laughs> she had, Lemia is not very good at naming, is she? She literally gave her child half her name as a name. <laughs> Lemia's daughter Mia. My mother has called a meeting in the Grand Hall. I wonder what she plans to discuss. I'm sorry it's so sudden, but she seems to hold every conference like this lately. Nash nah, gave me a full report of what happened in Lon. There's a great power within you, boy. As much power as Dime possessed in his youth. Cool. Uh, wasn't I supposed to wait back here? No. Where'd Nash go? <clears throat> okay. Missing something? I've been ordered by Lamia to pay special attention to this prisoner, so back off before I throw you into a cell of your own. Have you heard the rumor that the goddess Athena no longer lives in her tower? I went to discussing with a friend when Lamia overheard me, and I was sentenced to 20 years down here. I've never felt hatred for anyone the way I feel it for her. What am I supposed to do? I mean... It was wonderful. Mia smiled at me today. I haven't seen her this happy in a long time. I wish she would smile more often. It always brightens my day. It's a bit creepy. It's been a long time since Mia met with anyone in the Great Hall. She must have been extremely impressed with your success in Lawn. I knew I'd get some kind of reward, Alex. Oh, mine is a giant plate of fish and chips. <laughs> What's what you say to Mia? There's no telling how she'll react. When an outsider like Royce can claim such authority in the guild, something's very wrong. <laughs> I would gladly tell you the purpose of this meeting if I knew anything about it. <laughs> she seems to prefer consulting her fortune teller to consulting with me these days, I'm afraid. Oh, there we go. They're announcing the arrival of Lemia. 
you and your friends take your places quickly. Mm. Step fourth, Alex of Berg. Cutscene. Governess of the Magic Guild, I have heard you seek the dragons. I see the strength of your will in this regard in your eyes. And I sense something else. That eyebrow cock. I sense evil. Evil? You seek to destroy the Magic Guild and what? Althena. No, what? Lies. They're lies. You witch. You see, the boy says nothing because he cannot deny what he knows to be true. What are you talking about? Mia, what's going on? Guards? Throw this urchin into the dungeon at once and execute him for treason in the morning. Keep the girl here for now. I have special plans for her. Well... Alex! I am being executed as an urchin. Stop it! Let him go! <laughs> Screaming will achieve nothing, Luna. Here in vain, the word of Lumia also is law. Don't waste your breath on that little waif, Galleon. Take her to the appointed area. As you wish, Lumia. My precious. Luna! Alex! And all just casually floats away and nobody notices. Boop. <laughs> well, great. I blame you, Hazu. This is all your fault. You kept talking about murdering people. I, I, I don't know. Uh, Lamia, uh, also. Uh. That voice, it sounds so familiar. Hey, Alex, are you okay? I'm so sorry, Alex. I'll let you out of here right now. She sensed the evil inside of me. Which means she sensed your evil intentions of wanting to murder everybody. <laughs> Mia let me hide out in her bedroom. <clears throat> this is such an awful place. Please forgive me, Alex. My mother used to be so warm and wonderful, but now... Some... Mia. I'll, I'll knock you up later. But first, you have to get my other girl. Don't cry, Mia. Of course Alex forgives you. Now let's go find Luna, please. Alex, I want you to look at this. It's all of me. <laughs> Get Althina's mirror. This mirror shows things as they really are, Alex. It reflects only the truth. It is called Althina's mirror. I've been wondering if my mother is really the same woman she has always been, or if something has invaded and poisoned her soul. I was too afraid to know the truth, so I couldn't use this, but I'm ready to use it now. Please take me with you, Alex. It is my duty to learn the truth about my mother, even if I have a difficult time accepting what I find. Of course you can come, Mia. I can't leave one of my harem girls behind. Now that's the Alex I know. Let's go save Luna. But I guess we need to figure out where Lamia took her first. Do you know, Mia? I'm afraid not. My mother often disappears from the guild, but I don't know where to. Ah, the Vile Tribe! What the? I saw the Vile Tribe over there. I saw them! I saw them! Alex, that voice is muffled, but it's very familiar. Who could it be?
Look at her. She has fire magic and ice magic. You know, I don't know if I ever used ice shell. Maybe I did. I don't think I did though. All enemies, blizzard attack. One enemy, ice daggers. An enemy zone, fire pillars. Me and my girl. It's hard to be original these days. <clears throat> There's a bad smell coming out of this cell, Alex. This prisoner's been in here for quite a while. The mask she's wearing is a magical device. It's used to block memories. The guild forbid their use many years ago. Who would do something so cruel? And yes, it's obviously the Mia. Oh, the vile tribe. Ah, the Magic Emperor! The Vile Tribe? Did they do this terrible thing to you? What exactly is the Vile Tribe? My mother told me that they were a race of evil creatures. The goddess Althena banished them to the edge of our world several hundred years ago. But I've never heard of anyone called the Magic Emperor. The Magic Emperor? The Star Chamber. That's it! My mother forbade me from entering the Star Chamber. She scolded me the last time I even mentioned it to her. There's no doubt about it, Alex. That's gotta be what she's holding Luna prisoner. Let's go! Wait, we can't leave this poor woman here alone. Let's bring her with us. The Star Chamber is on the highest floor of the Crystal Tower. And the entrance is the door to the east of the Grand Hall. <laughs> Mia, your mother has not granted you permission to remove prisoners from the dungeon. Return him to his cell. I will take full responsibility for my actions, but I beg you not to inform my mother. And the guard just listens, I guess? Okay. I guess we'll save, even though I'm a fugitive now. Okay. No wait, not here. Up here. Wait, Mia! Nash? Mia, you're going to the Star Chamber, aren't you? Nash, you're a member of the Magic Guild. If you don't obey my mother's orders, I could be executed. I know. And I know the same thing could happen to you, too. I am the next leader of the Magic Guild. It's my duty to find out what's going on. And it's my duty as a member of the Magic Guild to assist my future leader. Nash. But I don't want to go out of duty, Mia. I want to go because I, uh... What, Nash? Because I'm sure that Luna is being held in that chamber. Besides, I don't want Alex to be the only one who looks cool, so let's go. Thank you, Nash. You're still getting cut, buddy. I hate to tell yeah. Uh, sure. In the name of the goddess Athena, I banish the magical seal placed upon this door. Let's hurry before someone finds out what we're up to. 